Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be rating different UK roleplay games. And first up, we have a game, let's find the name of it, called UKRP London UK. So, um, let's first off read the description for it. It says, London UK is a roleplay game which you are allowed to roleplay as a criminal, police officer, EMS and FBI agent. The game is still a beta, so you may encounter bugs. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up. Well, well then we'll, we'll be debating if it deserves a thumbs up or a thumbs down after this segment of the video. So, it, um, game, from this little area I can see here, the game seems to be fairly well made. Some vehicles are nice. I think these buildings are mesh, which is um, it's quite nice. Yeah, it's um, it's fairly well, nicely well made. Nothing really to complain about on that behalf. It's just a little settings icon. Okay, so if I put this on high, is that making a bit more detailed? It doesn't really. Let's have a look on our phone. Okay, so fairly basic, um, fairly basic phone. Not quite sure what this is over here. Oh, it's probably a second. <laughs> so, but that, that is incredibly loud. But, um, so yeah, it seems to be a car at Fast and Furious. I believe this is a Koenigsegg. Jesco, it's very loud. So we can, uh, oh, so we've got social. Okay. On this phone. Messages. Okay. And I believe this is the, oh, this is a bank. So I currently have zero money. It's sad. Is this calculator? Oh, that's nice. Nice little touch. Settings. What's in here? Phone type, social notifier sound. Okay, and then music. I assume a music player. Okay. So that seems to be that. Wow, this very goes very fast. We've already seen a Royal May station. There's all this like, nice little Tui area there. There's an Argos. Initial impressions. Game proportions are quite nice. Um, this vehicle is, I know for a fact, it's a free model. But, I don't know if this is permanent or if this is just a, in the meantime, um, vehicle. Nice little Sainsbury's there. I feel like it's in a meantime vehicle because it's stupidly fast and stuff. I'm currently trying to find out how you go on different teams and things. Okay, I see why it's in beta. This side of the map is very undetailed. The Royal Palace there? I have a feeling it might be a free model. It might not be. I'm not an expert when it comes to studios, but I don't know why. I have a feeling it might be. And then also... Dre no. Oh, God. Let's turn off the sink. I'm not, I'm not the best at driving on a minute. Now geographically, I don't my geographical skills on London aren't that amazing, I can't lie, but I don't think the Queen's Palace is next to there. And I know this is right, but I think there just might be some slight geographical errors. We're just gonna reset real quick. Won't let me actually reset, so I've just gotta murder myself. Quite intense. Thing. Oh, anyway, we're back. Oh, God. Oh, that's cool. You can, like, like lean with the guns. That's cool. Oh! So I'm in, I'm in a different spawn point now. I'm in a different place. Outside in Mackie D's. A little playground. It's quite nice. I believe this is a prison. From the looks of it, can I get inside anywhere? Is there like a front door? 
So yeah, this is definitely a prison. Which is quite nice. I believe this is like a whole prison block here. Yeah. Oh, motorbikes this work. It doesn't. Oh, it's unfortunate. So this seems to be a whole prison block here. Oh, so it's not too far away from where I spawned earlier. Same toy thing. One thing I have noticed though is uh, I'm okay with the police and the civilian, the prisoner, because now you've got to remember it's a UK based game. And I do have one slight concern of the fact that number one, they have EMS. It's not what we call it in the UK. And number two, they have. FBI, which again, we don't have in the UK, which I'm a bit concerned about when it comes to sort of if it is really a UK game, but it is based, it is based off of London from what I can tell, so they need to sort of choose what their game is. Because otherwise they end up sort of being two things. I would classify this as more of an American game to be honest. Just from the look of it, it doesn't really feel like London. I mean like there's a lot of UK things like this. That's the, these are these are in the UK. I'm not quite sure if this is a prison because it's very big. I'm starting to debate if it's a prison or not. I think it might be like a big university because each building's got like a number on it. I I think that's what it might be a big university because it's got like a tennis court and a basketball court. So yeah, I think it might. I think it's a university. That would make sense. I'm just gonna grab another vehicle on my hunt to find a police station or any station really. Let's just try whatever this is then. I'm going to all oh, it doesn't work. And those there I think that's actually is that actually just a skybox? Do they actually exist? I think from the looks of it, it could just be a sky box, or just like a big free model of a bunch of big buildings. Because look, it's just they're completely different. They weren't made by the same person. Who are you? Oh, so it's, it's a bar. Is this um? Is this P is this PG friendly? I'm just gonna get out of there. Some of the mechanics are a bit weird. What's this? Okay, I like that. They've added a bit of graffiti. Um, you know, so those are definitely... I think they're definitely real. They're just... Free model or something. Yeah. What's this? Just like a nice little car park. Yeah, I think they're definitely just a free model of sorts. Because they're just... Com they're completely different to com compared to that. So why is there any big ones over here? Why isn't there over there? Right, okay. This, I know it's a free model. I've seen it before on the free model thing. I've seen loads of times. This, I believe, is also a free model. These look actually quite detailed, so they might not be free models. Oh, no, they're just models. They don't even work. These buses don't even work either, and again, I think they might be just free. What does that say? London Customs. What the hell? Oh! I thought it was like a um, border thing. Okay. I like it. Yeah, they've added a, um, a garage where you can have cars and stuff. I like that, I guess. 
I still additionally made their own name. Now, unfortunately, since the cars aren't working for me, don't have time to tour this entire map. But I'll, I'll give I'll give my rating. This is kind of a part two to my previous video of um rating different roleplay games, but this one's more based on UK games. So um. For the first rating of use of free models, I'm gonna go for a seven out, a six or a seven out of ten, six and a half, let's say, because I'm just seeing a lot of this looks like it's now. I know some of it's free models, and then there is just a more that I have a big idea as a free model. Like for instance, I'm pretty sure that whole city is a free model over there. Because I don't know if you can see, but the style of building, it's just, it's completely different to all of this. This might actually be mesh, maybe. I don't think this is made out of parts, I think it's mesh. And that, I, I, don't, I, I don't even know, I think, I think that might be mesh as well, I'm not sure. But they're just, I hope you guys can see where I'm coming from, but it's just completely different. So that's going to be, so we're going to draw down to a 6, because it's a large portion of the map. And also there's a lot of vehicles, like probably 5 actually. 50-50 split-ish. Next up we're going to go with detail. I think this game, now although a lot of these vehicles don't work, I like that they've added them in to fill the game up. Otherwise this game would be looking very blank. I think it does make it look a lot nicer having things like these. I think this might be made out of blocks. Basically, I like the fact that they've added these different things. So more detailed. I like. I there's a few subtle details, like on those lamp posts, the high voltage sign. I don't know. I just like that. Things like that that most people, well, not most, some people would avoid, but. In this game, they've made sure to keep it all. I think these are slick with the road. Yeah, they're slick with the road. I saw this detail, I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. Nice amount of detail. Yeah, nice amount of detail. Not, I don't really have too much to comment on the detail. Next up, we're going to have quality of building. This sort of means, like, is that lamp taking them 2 minutes or 20 minutes? That sort of thing, like how good is the quality of the building? I personally think it's very, very different. Like this was say that I'd say that's quite detailed, you know. But then you've got like something like this building here is a bit bland, and that's I'm gonna, although I think in a whole it is a it is there's more detailed than there is non-detailed or more. Well beaten as non well built. So I'm gonna give it a eight out of ten. It's the highest rating it's got so far. And then finally Um How like realistic to the UK is it? Now this isn't gonna be very high. Purely because of the teams. It's different, it's difficult because it's got all of the vehicles and shops are very UK. Apart from London Customs, that's a slightly American name, in my opinion. But, so this is the FBI. I think just personally, the fact it's got FBI and they call it EMS, just really makes it difficult for me to see this as a UK game. These two buildings here, they just don't have very UK. They don't really, they don't know the sort of building that would be in London. So for that, I think I'm gonna give it a six out of ten on if I think it is actually based off the UK or not. I dislike that paramedic in charge. It's just no. That's not what a lieutenant uniform would say. So I'm going to leave it a 5 actually. It's just not a very UK game. And then finally, would I play this again? Unfortunately, at the current stage of beta, it's in. I wouldn't play this game again. I just personally think it's... 
it's not the um first off it's not it's not the best built game it's, it's not badly built they've obviously put some time into it but i just feel like they're branding it as a uk game but it isn't it's sort of a it's a game that is it's like, i think they should change it into a fictional place get rid of big ben because apart from if you took out big ben and the palace then and the bridges then there's nothing that makes this distinctively London. It could just be any city. It could just be any city. So I think they could turn it into a a non look like make up their own location for it. It's city of Greater R Riverside. I don't know. That's from look. That's from uh, you don't see. But you know what I mean. Make their own city because it's a well-made game. It's just isn't the UK. So unfortunately, I would not play it again. It's just not my sort of thing that I play really. But um, anyway, sorry about that. Someone just messaged me. I saw a bit of it. Um, yeah, I would like to leave. Unfortunately, I just I. I can't play it again. It just isn't my sort of game. On to the next UK game. That's what I'm. I'm looking for less popular games, really. Like, no, I know that's a good game. I think. I quite like the look of these two. Right, we're gonna go with. I think we're going to start off with this one. Yeah, let's start off with this one. Let's head into it. See, I like this sort of stuff. It's got quite nice pictures. It's got quite nice. Is it... UK BRC Brockwith BCR Brockwith County? I don't know where that is trying to be. Is that a real place? Let me know. I have a feeling it might be one of those sort of just based off the UK, but it's still a fictional place, if you know what I mean. I feel like it might be one of those because I haven't heard of Brockworth County. Don't think that's a county in the UK. Could be wrong. But I don't think it is. So for now, I'm going to go off the bait fact. It's based off the UK, but it's actually a different, it's whole, its own thing. A bit like what I think the other one should do. Okay, so we have administrator, a British armed police. There's a lot of, there's a lot of teams. I don't really like it when games do that. They have so many teams. It makes it just, I don't know. Oh, okay, so I've already spawned in with Block 19. Seems to be invisible. What about my other gun? Has I got audio on? I have. Audio is just a bit messed up. It's just. The actual gun doesn't make any noise. Yeah, that's weird. For carbon, maybe. Okay, so it seems I start off with all these guns, but can't use them. Which is a bit weird. Go oh, there. Oh, there we go. It's working now. I'm gonna just turn my turn the volume down for you guys. Otherwise, I might death death the new. And we don't want that, do we? Let's just turn it down a bit. Okay, I like that. It's nice. Let's, tr let's try the aiming out. It was really cool. From what I'm seeing, no bullet holes. So yeah, there's quite a lot of recoil, which I like. It's always good. Now let's try the. Hey, now let's try this one. Mm. 
Okay, I, I like the reloading. Wow, okay, that is that is quite powerful. M4 carbon. Oh, I like this. The shotgun. Okay. Decent shotgun. What's this? Game pass. Okay, there's none. Notes. Settings. Cool. Menu up here. Hmm. This is. Brunswick County is okay. It's a fictional county and is based in between Gloucestershire and Ox and Oxfordshire, comprising of a fictional parish area and aims to incorporate as much roleplay as possible into Roblox. This is a semi-serious roleplay game, so follow all the rules listed. Any moderator, any moderator decisions are not to be final. Are, are, to, are to be final, not to be argued with, and abusing any system may be kicked slash banned from the experience. That's in a different language, I guess. Okay, fairly um nice credits. Okay, a good update log. I quite like this menu. How do I exit it? Okay, so I'm teams. Okay. Can I just play? Can I just go on a team? Like, just. I don't want air support. I don't want firearms. It's not going to be deployed, that, is it? No. So yeah, I can't, I don't like it when people do that when they make all the teams whitelisted. It's a bit boring. Nothing in the shop. Okay. Is there any cars I can get? It doesn't seem to be a car spawner. So I can't, oh, a car spawn. Okay, let's get a BMW X5. See how well this is. Oh, okay. It's quite nice. Did I change all the gears? No, I just have to go into Okay, let's have a little drive around. Is that a bird? Okay, so it's got some weird movements, but I like that they've added a squirrel. Makes the game feel quite nice and realistic. Drive along here, there's a park, busting. I like the Road layer. I like the roads. Um, quite nice. I don't know. I just feel like there's less to talk about in this game. It's just I, I don't think there's like last game. I felt like there was a lot for me to talk about and judge on it. But on this game, I just I don't think there is really. It seems just seems like a a good game, I guess. Doesn't I don't know that in particular stands out to me. It's a nice car menu. I can't argue with that. It's quite nice. I think it's just too much forest. It's just so much forest. You can't see anything. It's just forest. So um, that's a bit weird that they've just decided to add all of this forest but can I shoot out my car I can what's my accuracy like I can't reload so I just kind of go don't 
Do I still have my stuff to drive? Oh, I can. Alright, let's just have a I'm not to have ammo so I can. Okay. Okay, so we've driven quite a bit now. Car's destroyed. What's this? Park. Cut park and ride. Okay, let's have a little look what this is about then. Hmm. Did someone else join? Oh, they did, but then they left. Oh, okay, so they should just have asked up at the moment. So, anyway, let's go on to rating. Because I just don't feel as much to want to talk. Sorry, I misclicked. First off, I think, was it detail? It, wa it was, yes, detail. So. Sorry about that, my mic is disconnected. I think the game is quite nicely detailed. I like how they have... I think they've made it all themselves. No free models. There isn't anything in here that screams free model at me. The trees might be, but that's not the end of the world, is it? Detail, like they haven't... Some of these trees are levitating. They haven't bothered to put them down, but I suspect they'd place them in a block. Um... Also, it would be a fairly high, like an 8 or 9 in the detail, but it's one thing that really just lowers the detail for me. Now, this could be what. No, I haven't seen a map of the county, so I can't give it a truly fair rating, but something I've realised is it's just forest everywhere. There's no sort of. They haven't bothered to make a map or anything. It's just forest. Which bugs me especially since this game isn't even in beta it's a functioning game it says including game pass cards there's no game passes the bank's too steep it's upcoming Bug fixes and it's our launch. Okay, so it isn't quite launched. I just I think it's, they haven't really. I feel like they should have made the map a bit smaller because it's just they've just added all this forest for no reason. So that is the that is a big problem for me. So I'm, that's why I'm gonna only rate the detail like a seven. Because it's just there's so much nothingness. So next up is build quality. Build quality now. I actually think they've done quite a nice job building it. So that's why I'm actually going to give the build quality a nine. I think it's just, it's really nice. There's a lot of nice stuff. I think they've they spent they spent a while making this game. And when you can tell that someone's spent a while making it, that's when you know it's good. Like the last game, I'm not convinced that that didn't take them more than like a just a day of searching for free models and looking for things. But this one looks like some a group of developers have actually spent a large amount of time making it. And I, th I feel like the tree thing just because the game's still in development but a little suggestion i have then if this is the case is to just make make the map a bit smaller for now don't shoot for a goal that's so big and then open when it hasn't really been completed so I, that's why i'm giving the build quality a nine oh just jumped out of my car next up it was how uk role plays it well, first off, there is a lot of teams. Oh, that. A lot of teams, they all seem fairly UK. I'd say this game is definitely UK. Nothing that makes it not UK. 
That's why I'm going to give this a, a, just a 10, really. It's, the, it's, it's a UK game. There's, there's no question about it. The last one was questionable. So, actually, definitely a UK game, yeah. And then would I play it again? At the moment, probably not, because... There's one bug when it comes to me with games. Is I don't like games that are difficult to navigate. For me, a criteria for a game when I play it has to have a map. I don't care if it's a map that shows you where you are on it or if it's just a map. I don't mind. If it's just a map that shows you where you are on it, you need to have some sort of road sign in. Every road needs a road name on it otherwise you have no idea where you are and it becomes effectively useless another thing that i that i need is a team changer they have team changers that's good another thing is a form of making money on civilian team without committing a crime it's a big thing for me and a lot of games that have it unfortunately ERC has done quite a nice job of it. You can work at a selection of stores and get a pay. You get paid. But this game, I just feel, hasn't really done it. <coughs> so that's why it doesn't really fit. I don't think that it also doesn't fit my criteria. So unfortunately, at the current base of development wouldn't play this game again i think give it a few updates when it becomes when they've really started turning it into a proper role game but game instead of just a beta which i think so anyway that i think is gonna pretty much wrap up today's video we've um We've looked at two games, and oh, there's one more thing that I was going to say. These pictures, personally to me, like this, does not look like the game. Nothing in the game looks that detailed. Now, I never saw the gas station, but if that's that detailed, then they need to sort of get their... Their priorities right of what they need to prioritize on. Okay, so it is so that was my bad. It is in alpha testing. Okay, so apparently you need a decent processor and a decent graphics card and it RAM. I don't think that's quite true. It didn't seem that difficult to run. I do have a decent PC, but I don't think there's really restrictions with. That. I don't think there'd be much restriction with that. But anyway, I very much hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you've had a great week. And you have a great week back at school if it is. If you are now going back to school. I am, so I won't be. I'll be nowhere near as active. Because I've got school to worry about and things like that. But I really hope you enjoy, hope you enjoy the holiday season. See you next one. Bye.